Hey everybody, I just had a very interesting presentation of SI joint. So a guy comes in and he's got pain down his leg that goes into his foot, okay? So if it goes into your toes, then it's usually sciatica, right? And, um, but it could be SI joint too. So the patient came in and no back pain, no back pain, right? And uh, pain in his leg, hurts to walk, pain, you know, shoots down his leg type thing and weakness in his leg. And every all his myotomes are intact, except for his dorsiflexors, they're about a four out of five, but you know, pain management's been doing injections, it has not helped. And they were, um, they said that, you know, you could be looking at surgery. So I opened up his SI, uh, I, op I, I opened up his SI joint and the pain came out of his leg, totally. Um, and I checked his dorsiflexors, but those were still, um, they were a little better, but still weak. So there still could be the nerve issue in his back. But um, but then he had weakness in his leg squatting down. So I had my assistant hold on to her under his arm, squat down. He's like, yeah, I can't really get back up. And then I held open his SI joint out flare after you pull on the leg, hold it open. And when, he, when I did, he goes, boop, comes right back up. And he's like, no, my strength returned. And I'm like, I've seen this before. Weakness in the quad, weakness in all the leg it can cause. So always check SI joint. No back pain, but this is what it was. Okay, peace. Love you all.